So we have the older and proven and tested ring alarm, and we have the new to the market smaller wise alarm. Which one is a better option to monitor your home? Let's find out. Hello guys, Lifehackster here. Today is going to be a quick video and just to compare the Ring and the Wise Home Alarm systems that I have reviewed in this channel. But first, if you find this video and matter videos helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it yet. And click the notification bell so as to get notified when I upload comparison videos like this one, product reviews, product updates, and long-term reviews. Thank you. I first reviewed the Ring Alarm when it was initially released 3 years ago and I've been using them ever since. I haven't really tested other brands except for the Wise Alarm which I did a few weeks ago. I will link my review and update videos on these brands in the description down below if you haven't checked them out. One big advantage of the Wise Alarm is its $5 a month monitoring which is probably the cheapest in the market today. But I'm going to tell you why being the cheapest has its limitations, and for price to features, I think the Ring Alarm is still the best choice if you're serious about your home security. I wasn't really planning to make a video about this, but based on what happened the last week of July, I just want to share my experience. The Ring Alarm, aside from being an alarm system, I probably use it more for the system to send me important notifications, like to let me know if power, internet, or both are out. Well, we were out of town for a week, and one night I got a ring alarm notification which said that I'm using battery backup power. And then another app notification stating that it is using cellular backup. So I know that there is a power outage at my home at that time. Anyways, with the ring alarm, you will get these notifications which I think are pretty important. What I usually do is check the next door app, making sure that our neighborhood had an outage and not just my house. Sometimes my electricity provider will also send me a text if it is an area outage, which in this case I did get their text. But with the Wise Alarm which was still hooked up after I reviewed it and on at the time when my power was out, I did not get any notifications. I know it has battery backup but I didn't get any notification on my phone that it is running in backup power. And I'm not sure why Wise didn't add this notification feature on their app. So, if I have the Wise Alarm at that time when my power was out, I will never know. And if the power was out more than 10 hours, then the whole alarm system itself will shut down. I know with the Ring Alarm, it has a bigger backup battery which can last up to 24 hours. Also with the Ring Alarm, when power and internet is back on, you will also get a notification. Also as I mentioned in my Wise Review video, the Wise Alarm is internet dependent. That means it will not notify you and even not notify their $5 a month monitoring service when somebody trips the alarm when power and internet is down. By the way, almost a majority of people doesn't have backup power on their routers. So more than likely if power is out, your router and internet will be out also. And we're not just talking about bad people trying to cut your power line so that they can get inside your house. What if you have a short in your electrical system that knocked off and tripped your breakers? And what if you're unlucky enough that the electrical short caused a fire before the breakers were tripped? If you have the wise home monitoring, you will never know. Another big advantage of the ring alarm over the wise alarm is the fire smoke and carbon monoxide detection. And I'm hoping that wise will add sensors and smoke detectors soon to add to their system. WISE do have a climate sensor which technically you will get a notification if the house temperature goes up or down. This can get triggered from our house fire scenario earlier if the house temperature went up because of the fire. Which might be too late anyways if it waited for your house temperature to go up before alarming. And if your breakers got tripped because of the electrical short then there will be no power and internet. Then you or the monitoring station will not even get an alarm notification. This is why cellular backup is important, especially if you advertise yourself as a home monitoring service. Lastly, Ring Alarm Siren is decently loud, but I know a lot of you still wanting it to be louder or at least have an option for additional sirens. Which they do, except Ring stopped selling their outdoor siren, so I'm not sure what happened there, but I did review it a while back which I will link it down below if you haven't seen it yet. Ring does sell an indoor dome siren though that you can add to their system. Anyways, with the Wise Alarm, its base station itself is pretty small and same goes with the siren. It is not loud enough. I'm not sure if they're going to add an add-on siren in the future. 
Now let's talk about subscription and if you're planning to add Wi-Fi cameras in your alarm system. Wise offers one free Cam Plus subscription and their $5 a month home monitoring and if you want more cameras that have their AI detection, then you have to pay for each camera subscription. Well, with the Ring, the $10 a month or $100 a year covers the alarm's professional monitoring and also the cloud recording of unlimited number of Ring cameras in your house. So if you already have Ring cameras around your house, adding an alarm system is a no-brainer because the monitoring is already included in their Protect Plus subscription. Another big benefit of Ring's $10 a month subscription is the extended warranty of their products, which also includes their alarm system. As long as you're subscribed, any issues on their products 3, 4, 5 years from now, Ring will replace it free of charge. I know $5 a month is pretty enticing, but if you add the additional features, sensors, and benefits of the Ring alarm system, it makes it a better option for your home monitoring and home alarm system. Cellular backup is one feature that Wise Alarm doesn't have that I wish Wise thought about first before making their alarm system. But one thing that really bugged me is that why set their home monitoring so that a user will have no option to use this to self-monitor their home. You need to be subscribed to their monitoring plan to use the home, away, and disarmed modes. Compared to the Ring Alarm, you are not forced to sign up for their professional monitoring. You can still use the alarm modes and you get notifications when sensors are tripped and you can decide if you need to call the police or the fire department. Well, that's it for this comparison. Any questions, comment down below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.